Good evening campers and welcome to Lotus Operations and in today's quick survival video I'm going to teach y'all how to tell time without using a watch and not using a sundial but this form of teaching is going to let you only know how many hours you have left in your day so let's begin Okay, campers, and welcome back to Lowe's Operations. And today I'm actually going to be teaching you how you can use your fingers to actually know exactly how many hours you have left within your day in case you are out exploring in the woods, lost in the woods, a survival situation, just so you know when the sun is about to set. Because when the sun sets, depending upon your environment, it could either critically hurt you because you're going to lose heat or it be in a dangerous situation if you cannot know which way you are traveling and stuff like that. Or it's actually just good to know when. And it's going to get dark so you can set up camp and actually be able to be ready for when it goes dark to go to sleep so let's begin okay guys so as i mentioned we are going to be using the sun and our fingers to tell time when we actually do the sunlight so the first thing you need to do is you need to know where your sun is and find the horizon okay guys so after you find the horizon within the sunlight you're going to basically be measuring from the tip of your fingers to and you want to hold it at at about an elbow's length away not dead straight not too bent you want to be at a very slight bend a natural very slight bend you know and then you're going to literally measure from the very bottom of the sun with the top of your fingers and then you're going to literally count fingers by fingers, not using your thumb. You don't want to use your thumb. It's just your four fingers. You're going to go from the bottom of the sun, like in this video right here, all the way down to the horizon. But, of course, you want to be facing the sun. So we're going to do that, and we're going to see how many fingers it is going down to the sun. So, basically, you're going to go to the bottom of the sun, wherever the bottom of the sun is at, and you're going to go down fingers by fingers like this. So this, these four fingers from the bottom of the sun is one out. Now, as you can see, my bottom fingers, I only did have to do two because that's how many fingers was left before we reached the edge of the horizon. So in reality, we have a total of one, two, three, we have about three hours and 30 minutes until the sun sets. And currently it is five o'clock right now. And the sun at this time of the year is setting between eight and 8.30. Now this doesn't give you an exact amount of time. Like, oh, it's setting at exactly 8.36. No, you know that you have about three hours and 30 minutes to three hours and 15 minutes, depending upon the arm length you hold your arms out to where you know where the sun will set. That's why I said it cannot be dead straight and it cannot be exactly pulled all the way in so you just want it to where it barely bends and that is the most accurate you're going to get to the actual time for the sun okay guys uh one more thing before i let you go you can also use that to determine what time it is if you know what time the sun rises so let's say if you know the sun rises at 6 30 in the morning and you're walking around in the day you go from the opposite horizon from the east to where the sun rises from and you count upward all the way from the horizon all the way up to the sun and then you can say okay the sun rose at 6 30 it's currently 12 o'clock or it's currently about 1 30 or about 2 30 and you can calculate your time from there well guys i hope you enjoyed that quick video on how to calculate the time using your hands and the sun so for survival purposes and more videos are on their way, a Lotus Operations out.